Mr. Fozzie for that uh, powerfully persuasive performance. I don't know what he said, but I believe it. <laughs> <laughs> Next, our fourth speaker is Dole O'Donovan from Mad Max.
And Donkey, not a stupid as he looked, discovered that as he was crossing the river, if he lay down and rolled a bit, saw the salt in the river, the bag got much lighter, he was much happier. <laughs> <laughs> but the farmer wasn't happy. And the farmer said, you know, what can I do about this? And Thaddeus thought for a minute and he said, sponges. Next time he's going, load him with sponges. To me, what you hear, the answer is obvious. It's logical. What was the problem? The problem was that something was getting lighter. How does salvia get something that when you put it in water gets heavy? It, it, it's, a, it's a beautiful solution, I don't know. But that to me is thinking logically, and to me logic is mathematics and so on. Okay. So I put that in one case, yes. Why don't we like just leave leave all the mathematicians and bring loads of sponges? <laughs> <laughs>
can do very little science without mathematics, and that's what I said at the beginning. And really, in a sense, a lot of that is obvious, so I'm not going to belabor it. That's why I'm trying to make some other points. But the plus with maths is that you also have an art. Mathem modern mathematics is an extraordinary cultural achievement. The, the only pity about it is that it's so difficult to learn the language, so most people don't see it. But it really is an extraordinary artful edifice. Okay, people. I'd like to conclude by saying I hope I've shown you why it figures. You should take my position. Thank you.